human factors, what a human will typically do is very important. And we need to understand how to make humans more resilient and make them centuries in this cybersecurity process. So technology has been the engine behind the growth of this nation and a whole lot of other nations. In that growth, uh, communications uh, expanded as we moved from the Stroger switch and we went to online databases and the connectivity and increase in speed between those databases. It created optimized business opportunities and reduced costs. As we got to the point where there was this reduced cost in memory and there were increased capabilities to store more data and supercomputers became these things that we carry around in our hands called smartphones. It gave everyone an opportunity to be a technologist. As these systems grew, the connectivity not only between universities and the good guys were enhanced, but for every development and every opportunity that we had to excel and advance our society, the bad guys gained the same capabilities. Before long, people saw an opportunity to enhance themselves and their wealth based on taking from other people. Whereas in the past, we would commit traditional crimes and go out and rob somebody or steal from them physically or maybe even break into their domicile and take their property. Now we could do the same thing digitally. The enhancements that were provided to society are the same enhancements that the bad guys are going to use to exploit us in our systems, our assets, and our networks. The problem is not only did individuals see these opportunities and organize crime, so did businesses and so do countries. So when trying to understand human factors, just Think about this. They've done studies where you will take a USB drive and put it in a conference room. That USB drive is a potential on route for hackers to get into computer systems. Although the people who work in that environment have been taught do not stick strange USBs into our computers, they will do it anyway. When later asked why you did it, the person that put the USB in the computer simply says, I was trying to return it to its rightful owner. This is the human condition. Good people will do good regardless of their training. And so, in developing and deploying cybersecurity practices, it's important to account for people and their propensity to do what's in their nature. We often fail to do this.